Now let's get another check of weather with Storm Track 3 meteorologist Garrett Hamilton. It is a sunny morning out there in Metropolis, but don't let the sunshine fool you. It is very chilly. We're sitting at 42 degrees this morning in Metropolis with a dew point of 41. So it certainly is feeling pretty dry and pretty chilly out there. But just look at all that sunshine out there on the horizon. Absolutely beautiful. But again, it is chilly area wide. We've even dropped to 39 degrees across Harrisburg and Piedmont. 41 coming in for Carbondale, 41 for Mount Vernon as well. It is still slightly warmer across Kennett at 50 degrees this morning. Now just to put it into perspective, right now we are sitting at 41 degrees in Carbondale. Our official record low for today is 42 degrees. So we may have just set a new record in Carbondale this morning. As we continue throughout the day today, we're not going to see these cooler temperatures stick around. It'll, it will be below average, but not that bone chilling cold that we're experiencing right now. We'll be sitting at 56 degrees by 9 o'clock this morning, 73 by 12 o'clock, 79 by the time we make it to 3 p.m. Skies all day today should be mostly sunny and we will likely see mostly clear skies through the overnight hours. Now dew points today once again are going to be running around 40 degrees later on this afternoon, so it is going to be quite dry. That means that we do have some elevated fire potential because those lower dew points are going to combine with temperatures in the upper 70s, giving us a relative humidity of about 20%, and we will see winds out of the north at about 5 to 10 miles per hour, so it is going to be quite dry out there. In addition to elevated fire potential today, we're also tracking highs that will be very warm as we get into the day tomorrow, and we are tracking the potential for more showers and storms as we wrap up the work week. Here's what we're looking at area wide by 4 p.m. today. Lots of upper 80s or lots of upper 70s and lower 80s. 77 expected for Corbindale, 81 for Cape Girardeau. As we go throughout the evening and overnight hours, we should see the temperatures return to the upper 50s. By midnight, we'll likely see the lower 50s to kick off our day tomorrow. Now tomorrow, we'll likely see temperatures warm into the lower 80s by lunchtime, and then we will see the mid to upper 80s and lower 90s for high temperatures area wide tomorrow during the afternoon. We're likely going to see the lower 90s for Wednesday, but as we get into Thursday, we do have about a 40% chance of scattered showers and storms, and that is associated with our next system. So certainly keep the Storm Track 3 app right there in the palm of your hand, because again, we are tracking our next really big system that could move over the region. And it's going to come from the Gulf of Mexico. Now, right now, that system isn't even named and it is very far to our south. But as we get into late Wednesday and early Thursday, that tropical system will slowly start to track off towards the north. I do think most of us are going to be dry on Thursday. As we get into late Thursday and early Friday, though, we will start to see a little bit of that rain as the system pushes off towards the north. And we likely will see rain stick around for at least a little bit in the day on Saturday. And when all is said and done over the next seven days, we certainly could see quite a bit of rain. Now, of course, this is still several days out, so we're still going to have to monitor this. But as of right now, it does look like that tropical system is going to move over our region in some capacity. 78 expected for the high today, 87 for Tuesday, 91 for Wednesday, 84 for Thursday, 76 for Friday, 77 Saturday, and 77 for Sunday. So certainly get out and enjoy that sunshine.